everyone. I was trying to think of something fun that I could do with you guys at home. And then I looked at my cute little buns and I thought, why not show you how to do some animal walks? What do you think, Roxy? Should we show them how to walk like animals? <laughs> all right, guys, I'm gonna show you how to do some frog hops, all right? So we're gonna get really low. We're gonna go on our hands and feet, just like a frog. And then you're gonna jump as high as you can like this. But what do frogs say? We have to rib it, right? Rib it. Rib it. Ready? And now we're gonna learn how to jump like kangaroos. So kangaroos jump really super high. So we're gonna bring our knees all the way up, just like a kangaroo. And then you're gonna try to jump over and over like this. And jump really super high and springy. And that's how kangaroos jump. Your giraffe walk. Your arms have to go over our head. Keep your elbows straight so you can't see your ears. And then go all the way up on our tippy toes nice and tall and walk around like a giraffe. Rebecca, I miss you all so much. And I'm gonna show you how to do an inchworm at home. Super easy. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna plant your feet. Then you're gonna walk your hands out as far as you can. And then maybe hold it for one, two, three. And then you're gonna walk your feet up and your hands are gonna stay. And you can even do it backwards. Have fun with your animal walks. Miss you all so much. Hey guys, so now we're gonna walk like ducks. So ducks are pretty small, so we're gonna get super duper low and get our wings. And we're gonna walk around and quack, quack, quack like a duck. And it's okay if you fall, because you can just come right back up and walk like a duck again. Okay, we're gonna do some bunny hops. So you're gonna get your feet right next to each other and your hands up by your ears. And you're gonna hop. Teddy, can you hop? Hop, Sarah here. Me and my assistant Sebastian are going to show you how to do a chicken walk. 